you know, cakes, teddy bears, pop-ups, birthday parties, whatever. The only decisions that have been taken in terms of expenditure to date are in relation to the, the pop-up, and that's the 18300 So, who, who? As well as the website, the sub-site. OK. Um, do you think you could perhaps pull it all together for me? Because it seems to me that it, the $18,000... Could you break down the $18,000? I mean, who paid for the cakes? Who paid for the teddy bears? Who's paid for the media? So, so the, the, there were no teddy bears in relation to the Medicare 40th? Oh, OK, right, OK. Well, I'll find one for you. Um, there, there are, um, in relation to urgent care clinics... Yep. OK, yeah. so we've got teddy bears for urgent care clinics too, do we? Not two. They're, they're the only teddy bears I'm aware of. OK, well, maybe you could get some numbers on the teddy bears too. Perhaps. Sure, I just the, really the teddy bears cost about $4,000 total. $4,000 worth of teddy bears, OK. For but they're in relation clinics. to the part of the promotion of urgent care clinics. And so what was the purpose of the teddy bears for, the, uh, for that? You know, like, like, like from, a corporate, um, from a corporate perspective, what, what, what value proposition were the teddy bears supposed to deliver in terms of giving people cheaper and easier access to health care? So they're, they're a promotional item uh, in relation to it. They're a very small part yeah, of no, a broader campaign that is about promoting uh, awareness of urgent care clinics, of their purpose uh, in the local communities. So we have uh, quite a comprehensive campaign that is then tailored to the, mm. the local area uh, that does um, uses uh, different sort of media channels, uses local footage of local uh, urgent care clinics to make sure that the consumers in the area uh, are aware of what the clinics mm. provide and of the, 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 the sorts of uh, services that they mm -hmm. offer uh, mm -hmm. and how to access those. Mm -hmm. So that includes, we've got case studies with yeah. health professionals Sorry. and patients, so social media content, all of respect. those things. I just asked you, um, I, I, I'm particularly interested to know what the value proposition of $4,000 worth of teddy bears was. I mean, what, when you decided, I made the decision we're going to get $4,000 worth of teddy bears, what, what was the rationale behind that decision making as to why you thought $4,000 worth of teddy bears was actually going to deliver a better health outcome for Australians when it came to access? So, I, I, As I said, Senator, they're part of broader promotion of the urgent care yeah, clinics. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing you. I just want to understand why teddy bears were considered to be. I would have thought the decision making in relation to access to health care was made by adults and not by children, and so I'm just keen to understand what the thought process was around the decision to use teddy bears. It's just a simple question um, about why teddy bears. That would be great. 